Hi everyone, I'm Jonathan, one of the newer members of the Together Church, here with your daily encouragement. As I expect you've noticed, we live in interesting and challenging times, and one of my favourite Bible verses comes to mind. Now I should explain that I prefer the version of this verse as it is found in the authorised or King James version of the Bible. You see, I became a Christian when I was 12, and one of the first Bibles I owned was a red letter King James Bible, with all the words of Jesus emphasised in red. This verse is part of Matthew's account of the Sermon on the Mount. So at this point in that Bible, there are several pages full of red text. But the one verse that stands out to me is the second half of Matthew 6, verse 34, where it says, Sufficient unto the day is the evil thereof. I remember telling my daughters this when they were young, and all I got were blank looks followed by, what? This is the part of the Sermon on the Mount where Jesus is saying, don't worry. And this verse in particular is saying, don't worry about tomorrow. There's enough to worry about today. But then Jesus also tells us that we don't need to worry about today either, because if we trust God, then we know everything is in his hands. Our Father in Heaven knows what is going on both today and tomorrow, be it in the world, in our country, or in our lives. So, I would encourage us all to give him any worries or concerns we have, whatever they are. And if we do what it says in the preceding verse, namely, Seek ye first the kingdom of God and his righteousness, then we can be sure of what Paul wrote in his letter to the Philippians, chapter 4, verse 7. The peace of God which passes all understanding shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Our Heavenly Father wants us to have his peace and that is just amazing. So keep your focus on him and you will have a peaceful day today and tomorrow. And just in case you're wondering, I generally read the NIV these days. Bless you all.